Okay, hi dancers for Jolly Old Saint Nick. This video is probably gonna be kind of disjointed, but I want to go over what we decided today about cleaning certain things. Um, so I'm gonna try and go through the dance piece by piece without the music and just talk about like where our hands are, where our feet are, um, all of that good stuff. Okay, so when we come out, just again, making sure that we're um, having fun. Hands are, I don't know, splayed, sunshine hands, because that's what we are going to do to just consistently do it through this dance. Like when we go up all the way, our hands are up here. So same things when we come in, um, fingers splayed. Um, so okay, so, and then we decided tabletop for the Lindy and crossing in front of us because that's gonna make it clean. Um, so jolly old Saint Nicholas and just be aware that your hands are not like too close to your face and also not, not all the way crossing. Um, so sometimes if we get lazy, our hands are like down here by our waist and maybe kind of crossing, but not all the way. So we kind of want to have a like center of our chest crossing. Jolly old Saint Nicholas. Um, tabletop, or we just, yes, we decided straight arms, tabletop for the shimmy. Lean your ear this way. Do, don't you tell a single soul. Oh, sorry. So, Lindy, Lindy. And then we're all good on the monkey. You're all doing it great. What I'm going to say, so I'm going to skip that. Um, Christmas Eve is coming soon. Uh, this is pretty good, just sometimes if some people get off. Um, so just be sure to practice it. So not the Lindy, but um, now you dear old man. So we're doing fists. Um, now you dear old man. So I do kind of a little bump halfway through and then like a bigger bump when I'm getting my hands all the way over here. Now you dear old man. And then we're gonna walk with purpose without walking with like great purpose. Um, you know, whisper what you'll bring to me. And we decided we're gonna point the toe. So point, ball change, point, ball change, prep. And the pencil, pencil turn, but arms out. Point, ball change, point, ball change, prep, and turn. Okay, point, ball change, point, ball change, prep, and turn. And I'm doing it a little fast, so I'm falling over, so. But we turn, hands down here, and we're just turning in pencil. Um, and then we have Jolly old Saint Nick, up by your face. Sometimes we get different places. And every time we do this, um, we want to make sure we have all the claps in. It's really fast, so it's really on the last ones that I notice that we get lazy. So we like do it for the first couple ones, and then by like the third and fourth one, we come sometimes like skip the last clap. Uh, Jolly old Saint Nick. And then the new thing is we're turning just once and then we're doing a little coupe kick, I guess. I'm not a dancer, so I know that's the term, but we're not up here. We're just like an ankle tap. So ankle tap down, ankle tap down. And that'll help because it is really quick instead of like having to bring your leg all the way up here and throwing it off balance. So ankle tap down. So it'll be Jolly old Saint Nick. Jolly old Saint Nick. Sorry, I did that wrong. Let's try it again. Jolly old Saint Nick. Jolly old Saint Nick. And then we decided arms. Jolly old Saint Nick. And hands splayed. And then we're keeping our legs apart. Um, and knees a little bent and kind of just swaying. 
a little bit. I mean, you can bring the back of your heels up a little bit if you want. We're not coming all the way in and we're not even picking up our feet and doing that a little bit. Um, so it's jolly old Saint Nick, he, uh, the words, jolly old Saint Nick, he's actually, that's something we need to talk about and I forgot to talk about is how we are getting from here to here. Um, so I think some people are like letting down and then popping up and maybe some people are keeping their arms here. So I need everybody to think about it and we can decide next week. Um, jolly old Saint Nick keys. I think it makes more sense to keep them up here because we're kind of doing this and just kind of keeping it here and then we can really be a pop. Um, that's my opinion, but we can talk about it next week. So jolly old Saint Nick keys coming to your heart soon. Um, that is kind of as far as we got really like breaking it down piece by piece. Um, we talked about a couple things at the end. I'm going to go ahead and keep moving forward and think about if there's things that we can repeat that we cleaned in the first part and we can do in the second part. So same thing for moving, not super purposeful with like swinging arms, but da -na 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 -na, da -na 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 -na. um, so I think this is pretty good. I think everybody's got this pretty good. I know I myself actually need to be a little looser um, to match everybody else. So I'm gonna work on I'm gonna work on that. Let's do legs together when you wash your hair, wash your hair out and in. Um, this part, some people are off sometimes. Sometimes it looks great and everybody's together. Um, so just watch this part where our hands are together, what I would say in like a cheerleading kind of clap, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Keep, just practice that. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Sometimes I think some people get off on the rhythm. I'm gonna try and do the off rhythm, um, but I'm not sure if I can do it. I, like, I see people do it, but I'm not really sure how it happens. Um, so like, da -na 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 -na, like doing this faster, I think than the count actually is. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Um, and then we've got fist. We're gonna keep this hand down and kind of blade. So it's fist, fist, prep. So this is the same prep and turn as the first half, prep and turn. Um, and then I think, and yeah, this is the part where we then go back or forward and we all kind of forget that that's the next move. So prep and turn one. I think I need to move back with my right foot first, if I remember correctly. So prep and turn one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Um, at the end, not everybody may have caught it, but instead of going like this, we are gonna like break down your arms. So we're all the way up, but then we're breaking it down. Uh, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, this part looks pretty good, I'm pretty sure. Um, I'm pretty sure we're all pointing, so we kind of like point, 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 point. Um, and now I can't remember what comes after this. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Um, all right, I can't remember exactly without the music, but let's all just practice, especially I think the, the second half and remembering what comes after each move um, because when we first started, I mean, it got better over practice today, but um, the part where we have our different parts and we're pointing at everybody, everybody seems to kind of forget the beginning there. So we've got jolly old Saint Nick, da -da 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 -da. jolly old Saint Nick, that side's doing their thing, Ted's doing his thing. 
uh, he's, so I know, I, I think what I skipped was the next grapevine, which we might change because um, Jesse was saying as somebody who has not really watched this dance before and seen it, it looks a little bit messy and like people don't know what they're doing, even though we're doing what Tony asked us with this half facing this way and other half facing this way and then Ted doing the turn by himself. Um, so I need to talk to Jesse and see if we want to change that so it looks like we're all doing what we, that, that just doesn't look so, I guess messy is the only word I can think of um, from the perspective of somebody who, you know, hasn't seen the dance and hasn't been following the dance up to this point. Um, but that's also a part that we forget. And maybe that's what I'm forgetting is maybe it's after this. Uh, oh wait, there's another turn, that's right. Cause there's a turn bef right before we do the grapevine again. Um, so let's just make sure again that that turn is the same as the other ones. And then we have the grapevine, which we know how to do, and it'll be the same, you know, hands as the other grapevines. We'll just work with maybe what way our bodies will be positioned. Um, and then at the end, um, I know I said tabletop today for one and two, three and four, five and six, seven and eight. Um, but we can talk through, because I think we might have actually learned or some people might be doing like, so we need to just see kind of what looks better. If, every, if that looks, that feels good and everybody looks good together, like kind of moving the arms like that, we can do that. Otherwise, if it doesn't look so good, we might go to tabletop. And then we just need to make sure and prep and spin and hit that last move. So again, working on that because it is faster than some of our other spins or like maybe the spins the same speed, but then really like getting popping on that last um, hit just comes a lot faster than we think. And I'm pretty sure we're all doing the same thing and we're popping with our hands splayed like we did through the rest of the dance. Okay, thank you for bearing with me as I kind of just talked through the whole thing. Uh, I hope this makes sense. Please feel free to email me um, anytime if you have questions or um, concerns or need some help. Um, happy to, happy to, happy to help. Thanks so much, guys. Bye. Happy practicing.